Wilder is considered the most powerful puncher in boxing today. Tall and thin for a heavyweight, he is a master of the one-hit knockout. Across the Atlantic two. Oh, oh, the shot! His knockout to win percentage stands at 98%, with 20 knockouts in the first round. The bronze bomber didn't leave even the slightest chance for his opponents, destroying them before the second round. He is a two-time winner of the Premier Boxing Championships Knockout of the Year Award in 2016 and 2017, and the winner of the Ring Magazine Knockout of the Year Award in 2019. So without further ado, let's check out Deontay Wilder's Top 10 Most Vicious Knockouts. Wilder made his professional debut at the age of 22 after winning a bronze medal at the 2008 Olympic Games. He just needed two rounds to make his point, and what a point it was. Wilder sized up Ethan in the second round, pushing him back with a long, strong jab. Ethan was thrown back against the ropes by a second left hand, setting up an ideal chance for Wilder to use his signature move, the overhand right. Lykovic's career did not go as planned for the Belarusian, as he is now most known for his fight with Deontay Wilder and the tragic knockout that followed. Wilder finished Lykovic with a right hand midway through the first round, but the outcome wasn't pleasant. As his body collapsed to the canvas and his legs began to shake, it appeared like the boxer had lost all control. Right hand. And then once Lahovich went to the ropes, that was it. And look at Lahovich's reaction. A nice bag on his back. He wants to stand. Look at that reaction, though, with Barry. That was that was very very scary. Yes, it was. Wilder made the heavyweight division seem easy in his first three years of professional boxing. When he fought long, he made it 20 knockouts in a row, and he accomplished it in the first round. The battle started off as expected, with both boxers putting their jabs to the test. Wilder's appeared to be considerably more credible, and his right hand was even more so. The goal was Long's chin, and Wilder nailed it. Do a massive count when the guy's on That's it. That, that was I've had a seat. 13 fights, he's won 11 of them, and he's managed to stop seven of them. Then he pulled off two major upsets. Instead of a boxing fight, Wilder, who towered over Arnold, engaged in what can only be described as bullying. Arnold was being dragged all around the ring by Wilder's speed, and it was just a matter of time before he connected clean in the opening round. A fast left-right combination one minute into the fight left Arnold flat on the canvas. This was the start of Wilder's career. It looked like the young American would only cause more as chaos. Teacher, as a trainer, one of the greatest amateurs of all time and a former world champion. There goes that punch we were hit with right hands. He leans on the right side. That is in the alleyway of the right hand and behind the ear. Rematch between Deontay Wilder and Berman Stavern. In their rematch in 2017, Stavern made a lot of noise leading up to his near-death experience with Wilder, and it backfired. Tomorrow, I'm going to deliver what I told you. I'm going to knock his ass out. I promise you. I'm make a dance tomorrow night. I'm going to crack your ribs. I'm going to crack your jaw. I'm going to send you home packing, and you will retire. Wilder's opponent was knocked down three times with the third knockout confirming that Stavern was unfit for a heavyweight title fight. Although it wasn't the cleanest KO of Wilder's career, it was by far the most terrifying. In December 2016, Wilder found himself in one of the toughest moments of his career against Eric Molina. Midway through the fight, Eric rocked Wilder, and he had to hold on multiple times to recover from the damage done by his opponent. Some momentum, and he catches Wilder with a left hook. Molina on the attack. But like with all of Wilder's fights, he had his one moment in the ninth round. The bronze bomber delivered a left hand that knocked Molina down before finishing him with a right hand. Time in 
the American Dream, but right now he just landed. Wilder did a nightmare. Leave this. Oh, oh good shot. Like well, this is a great shot, and he goes down faster than a plate of Alabama barbecue. And Wilder. This rematch took place in Las Vegas, Nevada, in November 2019. Luis had won the opening six rounds, and Wilder had a lot of work to do in the second half of the fight to level the fight up. Wilder, however, not only leveled the fight by the end of the seventh round, but he also put an end to it. The Cuban was defeated for the second time when his legs failed to support his body, following a series of swinging punches that put an end to his night. And gets the position he wanted. Bam! It wasn't just one shot last time, it was several. It was the, the upper. It was all it took, and Deontay Wilder stays the heavyweight champion of the world. Deontay Wilder! We got a mouthpiece here? Yes, sir. Price came into this fight undefeated and the fact that he could match Wilder's height and reach added spice to this fight. Before the battle, both opponents were theoretically evenly matched. After the fight, they were anything but matched. Price was hitting Wilder with several shots, but in the third round, Wilder took matters into his own hands when he unleashed his monstrous right hand directly towards helpless Price. Across the Atlantic too. away for the bronze bomber I, I, I knew the right hand going you're gonna get hit regard you're gonna get hit it's just when you're gonna get hit Wilder. in the next four weeks Anthony Joshua and Tyson Fury both want to conquer the night Wilder dropped Dominic to the canvas with one devastating right hand was one of his most brutal Dominic, who was stopped in the seventh round by Anthony Joshua in 2016, was floored in the first round by Wilder. A 1-2 combination stunned the fellow American fighter, demonstrating to the rest of the world that Wilder is capable if given the chance. Careful. The countering shot suddenly hurt. And the right hand, and that's good night! Dear Wilder retains his word to make it, and it is over in one round. The 20 knockout victory for Deontay Wilder, who does have the most extraordinary. This fight is definitely among Wilder's top three since it was named the Knockout of the Year by Premier Boxing Champions. In the first three rounds, Artur appeared to be in good condition with his quick moves and sliding blows looked fantastic. In the ninth round, the Polish boxer switched tactics and attempted to and make a one move. Punch in the ninth. Wilder landed a powerful right that ensured two things. One, Wilder maintained his undefeated record, and two, Artur got a good night's sleep. Fury stepped into the ring at the end of the fight and confronted Wilder, making the start of a classic heavyweight rivalry. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, press the like button and subscribe to the channel so you won't miss any new videos.